Let's talk about crypto patents. So in the recent years, big enterprises and corporations like IBM or Alibaba have registered dozens and like hundreds of crypto related patents. You could imagine that this poses a threat and problem for the wider open source community and it um, yeah, prevents innovation happening in our industry. So that's why um, Jack Dorsey and Square launched the Crypto Open Patent Alliance, short COPA, which um, basically gathers members with or without crypto patents to form somewhat of a shield against either um, patent aggressors who are um, yeah, trying to, um, let's say, attack existing projects or companies because they are like essentially saying that these projects, companies using their crypto patents or technologies um, or by just trawling um, with, with patent um, claims. Um, and um, on the other side, it also creates a shared pool of um, yeah, available patents to all the members um, who pledge to make their patents, um, which are crypto related, freely available to the other members. Um, which obviously will then benefit each of the members and can um, strive innovation um, and advancements in, in the technology um, inside these companies. Um, and yeah, I'm happy to announce that the LISC Foundation has joined COPA as a member. We have decided to not, a re to not register a patent for the LISC interoperability solution um, because we want it to be a hundred percent open technology. There are going to be many, many blockchain applications which are going to use our um, interoperability solution and we don't want that they fear that we might prosecute them or come after them. We are not intending to do so um, and that's why we don't even need a patent for our technology. So as we have always done in the full open source spirit. Um, however, we decided to join COPA um, once in order to uh, like support this organization. Um, second, to make use of um, the patents available in the patent pool. Maybe in one point in the future we need them. Not right now, it's not planned, but who knows? You never know. And third, that in the case in the future we're going to register a patent um, by being a member we also pledge to make these patents we're going to register freely available to anyone in that group so by that we are sticking to our promise no matter what happens um, and other members of Coper include Blockstream, Coinbase or Kraken so big big companies uh, which are supporting that effort and I'm very happy and very excited to join that and um, I'm uh, really looking forward to where this is leading us. Um, we really have to put up a fight against the big enterprises and corporations um, so that they're not stopping innovation from happening within our industry. <laughs>